What's going on YouTube? GSNoRight here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to jailbreak iOS 11.0 up to iOS 11.1.2 with Electra and how to get Cydia from that. The uh, Electra with Cydia has been finally released and you can see here on Coolstar's Twitter he announced just a couple hours ago quote Electra 1.0 available now with Cydia and the link for the Electra. Make sure to read important information before installing. Now if you check out in here on the Electra website you can download the Electra jailbreak break for the iOS 11.0 up to iOS 11.1.2, which is compatible with all iPhones on 64-bit and running iOS 11, the iPod Touch 6th generation, iPad and iPad minis that are running iOS 11 in the current range. So um, this is the uh, download button for the version 1.0.1. A couple hours ago the 1.0 has been released, but there have been quite a few problems with the Topanga and false positives, and so the 1.0.1 has been released, which fixes some of the false positives. So uh, in order to download it, you have to press the download button here and you will get the IPA, you need to sideload with the Cydia Impactor. So in order to jailbreak iOS 11.0 up to iOS 11.1.2 with Electra and Cydia, you need to have a computer on hand. Now the computer can run Windows, Mac OS or Linux, uh, the uh, Cydia Impactor works for all of these. Now something very important, Coolstar also announced in here, quote, Winterboard is not supported on the Electra or iOS 11. I will not be fixing it, use an enemy. So for those of you who do not know, Winterboard is a theming platform that allows you to install the themes. Anemone is the same thing, but in my opinion much better. And the Anemone is created by Coolstar. He also says in here, quote, for Anemone make sure to get the rocket bootstrap from the uh, repo in here, which is Ryan's repo. Okay, so um, this is the IPA, I got it in here, Cydia Impactor is available on cdaimpactor.com, the link is available in the description down below. And what you need to do is to pretty much connect your device as I did and wait for the IPA to download. I have downloaded the IPA, for some reason it worked very very slow, probably due to the fact that everybody's downloading it right now. But anyways, once it's copied on your desktop you will have to drag it and drop it with the device connected and you will have to sign in with your Apple ID and your password. Let me do that. Okay, so once you signed in, your device will start to get the application installed, which contains of course the Electra with Cydia. Now for those of you who have installed the leaked version of the Electra, it's quite bad since there might be problems. But if you didn't install the leaked version that has been posted a couple days ago, then you will be fine. I'm going to switch to the device and show you how you need to jailbreak with the Electra. Okay, so I'm on the uh, device. Unfortunately, my device is running iOS 11.2.6, so I will not be able to jailbreak it with this version of Electra, but I'm going to show you what I need to do from this point on. So, you have Electra installed in here, but it's not going to start. You can see it says untrusted developer. To fix that, you need to go to settings in here and to general. Here on the general, you have to scroll to device management, find your email address in here, and of course, press trust. Make sure you're connected to a Wi-Fi uh, network, and there you go. Now the Electra will start. And as you can see, Electra started properly. Now instead of version error, your button will say something like jailbreak. You need to press it, your device will restart, and you will be jailbroken. But unfortunately, in my case, I'm running iOS 11.2.6, which is far more than Electra can support. For those of you who did not get it, iOS 11.0 up to iOS 11.1.2 is the maximum you can um, jailbreak with Electra. So if you're running iOS 11.2, this will not work. Now you have more information about it in here, the credits and everybody who have contributed to it. So yeah, this is pretty much the jailbreak application. For those of you who are wondering whether this is untethered or not, it's not untethered, it's semi-untethered, so this means that you will have to re-sign it with Cydia Impactor every 7 days. I definitely recommend against the um, versions coming from Tweakbox and other third parties like that that are signing it for one year because jailbreak applications can be infected with malware which is quite bad so um yeah i definitely recommend getting the electra only from the official website and only 
uh, from Coolstar. So yeah, this is pretty much how you jailbreak it. Unfortunately, I cannot show you exactly how I'm jailbreaking my device because it's not compatible, but this is pretty much the entire procedure. After restart, you have Cydia and you're good to go. So thank you for watching, guys. Do not forget to subscribe to stay updated and do not forget to install Not Today Satan, which is a very, very important tweak. You can find a uh, list of the available tweaks in the description down below for the Electra, but Not Today Satan is pretty much a tweak that will block the Indian character that crashes your device on iOS 11. So that would probably be my first tweak to install if I had iOS 11.1.2. So yeah, thank you for watching, I'm Geosnow, do not forget to subscribe to stay updated, peace out!